Why do you need to buy insurance and what kind do you purchase? That's a great question. Well, it's really going to depend on your age, your lifestyle, your debts, goals, and probably most importantly, your obligations at home. There are so many different kinds of insurances out there, but really they boil down to two different kinds, whether you're buying permanent insurance or temporary. Permanent insurance, I, I liken it to you're buying a product that you're going to own. It's physically something that you own, it's an asset, and you'll hang on to it your entire life. Temporary insurance is really what it just sounds like. It's something you're going to own for a period of time and then you're going to let it go. So what kind of insurance do you need? Well, it's really going to depend on your, your entire financial situation at home. But there are three big ones that we should really be looking at. There's life insurance. That's the one that pays out in the event of your death. Your, your uh, beneficiaries will receive a sum of money, most likely tax-free, and then they can use that to supply them with a, a stream of income in the event that you die young and they, they need an income stream throughout their, their lifetime. Sometimes life insurance is owned to help with estate taxes, or maybe you've got a cottage or a business that you're trying to transition down to the next generation. So permanent insurance might be a great product. Disability and critical illness. Now these are products that most likely will be used by the insured or the individual buying the product. Disability insurance is one that provides you an ongoing stream of income if you're disabled due to an illness or an injury. So imagine you're working for a living and you're in a car accident and now your income stops. Well, disability income would provide you with ongoing stream of income until you are able to recover and go back to work. And then finally, critical illness insurance is a product that provides you a lump sum tax-free benefit in the event you're diagnosed with a, an illness, cancer, or maybe you have a heart attack or a stroke. Why is this important? Well, what we're finding is many Canadians today are being diagnosed with an illness like cancer. They're still surviving and living longer, but ultimately their expenses have gone through the roof. And so this lump sum benefit provides the family with cash when they need it most. The other thing you need to consider is do you have benefits at work? And if you do have some sort of benefit plan at work, you may want to make sure that, that insurance products that you're buying outside of the benefit plan is coordinated with that group insurance so that you're not over-insuring one individual and potentially under-insuring the other. So, do you need insurance and what kind do you purchase? That's a great question. Hope that helped. Thank you. For more information, I invite you to check us out on LinkedIn. Send us your questions because every question is a great question.